Hey guys, welcome to The Bearded Story. My name is Matthew and today we're taking a trip to New York. No, not really. But we're gonna be talking about these guys, Veteran Beard Company. The owner's name is Lewis. He is a veteran of the Army. He officially started his business this year, February 1st of 2019. He's got some outstanding smells that anyone who buys his product, I'm quite satisfied you're really gonna enjoy these. So stay, stay tuned, we're gonna get right into these. Beard Company. You can find them at VeteranBeardCo.com, Facebook, and Instagram. And Lewis was kind enough to send me this hat plus three oils and four bombs. Now one of the bombs is not labeled, and I'll tell you why in just a second. So let's get into the oils first. We have Valor, Rebel, and Fury for the scents. And let's talk about the bottle in just a second. They are one ounce containers. These are $15.99. And you'll notice a lot of white going on here. Really clean and crisp looking. This looks really good sitting on a shelf right next to your sink or where you get ready of the morning. The dropper tops, they pull it about three quarters of the way up. It's really good. Yellow cast it all. It's a medium consi consistency on the oil or medium weight oil. So Valor, this is sandalwood and vanilla. This is more vanilla than sandalwood. It might be a 50-50, I don't know. I pick it up in the vanilla first and then sandalwood is boom, it's right there. This is very good uh, smelling oil, guys. Um, last about, you know, 10 hours, easy. All three of these did. It's non-greasy, felt really good in beard, hydrated well, done really good on this oil. And the ingredients on this is castor oil, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, coconut oil, vitamin E, and fragrance, and natural oils. Now, he uses mainly natural oils. He uses very minimal drops of the uh, fragrance oils and because I, I distinctly asked him about this. Rebel. If you've not heard about Rebel, this is an oud scent. And I have three oud scents in my collection. And my wife, even commented on this. She said, this smells better than the other two that you have. And I agree with her. This actually smells better. It smells really good. So this is made up of cypress, ozone, lime, oud, elemy, amber, and frankincense. And I think the cypress and the frankincense is kind of toning the oud out, giving it a very clean, uh, distinguished smell. It's very, very nice. I really like this. But he has one that I actually prefer better and is my favorite among the three. I love a good oud smell, but I'd rather wear this next one first. And it is Fury. It's not a mean <laughs> oil, but okay, here are the ingredients on this. It's orange, bergamot, clove, leather, oak, and patchouli. This scent is layered very nicely. All these ingredients just mingle and mesh terrifically. It is a uh, sweet oil that is, it just lasts all day long. And I actually got a compliment today that it, I, it smelled so good and I agree with them. This smells very good, and I actually love this more than the oud scent, and I love oud. So if I had to pick one, it would be the Fury. So let's talk about his bombs. How are they doing? They are two ounce bombs. They go for $16.99, and it is white labeling, front and back with the ingredients. So the ingredients on his bombs are shea butter, cocoa butter, beeswax, jojoba oil, almond oil, coconut oil, vitamin E oil, natural and fragrance oils. This is a medium consistency on his bomb. It is yellow casted just a little bit. It uh, comes out very nicely 
with the back of your fingernail or your guitar pick, however you prefer to do it. But just to take your finger and scrape in there, it is a little tougher bone, so you will need to use your fingernail or something, you know, like that. Felt really good in beard, held my beard all day long. I worked 10 to 12 hours a day. This held all day long. Emulsifying went right away, very smooth. The scent profile on this is just like the oils. There is a very slight uh, balm smell. You, you can't hardly pick it up. This is a really good balm. I do suggest both his balms and oils. And it's like that for all three of these balms. Now, today being Friday, March 1st, we do have a new scent releasing. It will be available for uh, delivery within a week. I think you can actually pre-order it starting today, March 1st. But uh, I think it may actually ship next week, you know, about a week. And the scent on this is still a mystery. Can't no, I'm gonna tell you. The scent name on this is Freedom. And this is a cologne scent. I really like this. Um, and the ingredients on this is mint, lavender, musk, cedarwood, amber, and a little bit of barbershop smell. And I can smell the musk, a little bit of lavender and cedarwood, and an old barbershop scent. It's just, if it was a cologne, I would wear this cologne. It smells that good. The consistency, again, it's a medium weight balm. Smells really good. I, re I wish I had an oil for this. Hint, hint, Lewis. No, I'm just kidding. You've done more than enough. I actually paid for some of this product, guys, and just to help Lewis out because this is really good product that he does have here. And I will suggest all his oils and balms. And I hope he comes out with some cold washes and uh, uh, butters also to match, especially the Fury. I love the Fury scent. It's, oh, it's nice. It's a sweet uh, orangey smell. If you like a good cologne scent, Freedom is your guy. Like I said, his balms are $16.99. His oils are $15.99. I'm gonna help you out a little bit right there with a discount code and it's it's all caps lock STORY15. Now to get you 15% off for a limited time only. I'm not sure how long Lewis is gonna run this, but uh, I do know it's for a limited time. So take advantage of the 15% off to grab either the Rebel, the Valley, the Fury, or the Freedom, his newest release sent today. And I want, Lewis, I just wanna thank you for making an outstanding product. It is affordable. It's right in the mid-price range of where market value is for one ounce and two ounce oils and bombs. And I really appreciate it, brother. Guys, thank you for watching. If I can do anything for you, leave me a comment down below. If you got questions, comments, concerns, shoot it in the comments below. I invite you to hit that subscribe button, tag the bell, and give me a thumbs up if you like the video. <laughs> but uh, go check them out. Veteran Beard Company, veteranbeardco.com, Facebook, and Instagram. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time right here from Tennessee. Stay bearded, and when in doubt, grow it out. See you.